Oh, Terry Funk, uh, talking about uh, Terry Funk, uh, as I believe uh, we were talking earlier, Hannibal and I, uh, about how literally how tough he is, uh, one of the toughest human beings really on the face of the earth to take the abuse he's taken in professional wrestling. And uh, I believe uh, that, uh, in my opinion, uh, he's one of the greatest uh, uh, performers of all time, and psychologically, uh, his 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 mental approach to professional wrestling is is un, unparalleled. He has such great ring psychology and uh, his performance at performance level and his ability to uh, to take punishment is uh, is amazing. And I'm just so so impressed with him that uh, I rate him uh, up there with the Harley races, uh, the select few that are really really icons and really legends that you can apply those words to, that would be to a Terry Funk, who is a very rare individual. And I did a painting, I did a, I did a portrait of Terry Funk. I felt compelled uh, to put him uh, on canvas. I did a special uh, painting for Terry and presented it to him in uh, New Jersey at a big autograph signing event that was very successful and a lot of fun and he's thrilled with it. And uh, I'm thrilled with it, and it really, really came out nice among, like I said earlier, a Ric Flair, uh, an Iron Sheik painting. I'm doing a, 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 a Hannibal painting that is really going to be an awesome, probably one of my favorite paintings that I can feel already. Artists have feelings about certain artwork, and I really have a great feeling about this painting I'm doing for Hannibal. So that'll be broadcast everywhere when it's, when it's finished.